this is the package I've just received. Let's open and see what is this. Oh, beautiful. The Skywatcher Heritage 90 Virtuoso. I bought this especially for its mount. Of course, you get a Maxitop telescope with this 90 uh, millimeter. Beyond your imagination. The mount is really good and the bracket comes with it also. Let's just open it and see. It's exciting. Okay, it's well packed. It was well packed. Now let me open this cellar tapes. Uh -huh. Oh, the cellar tape is just superficial to protect it. Yeah, let's see what is inside. Hmm, well packed so far. So good. Okay, another layer of protection. Okay. Uh -huh. What is this? It's just for something to protect the baggage. Okay, give it extra padding. Mm -hmm. Nicely packed. Oh, that's the actual back set of tube. Okay, there's a little scratch here. And this is the telescope itself. Let me remove the cap, see how is the optics. The optics looks good. I don't see any major problem with it. Actually clean. I'm going to put the lens cap back. Okay, let me put this aside. Okay, this is the mount also, as you can see, is uh, fully functional, it turns in uh, latitude and in azimuth, so it's completely functioning. And a lovely manual for this telescope so this is the manual and uh, the rest of it is now here okay let me put these things back to the box i'm sorry i want to use it tonight i just want to add that what i didn't see in this package was a viewfinder which goes here should be a dot, red dot viewfinder. Um, don't know what to think. Probably the missing part. Okay, about this telescope, which is a Skywatcher Maxatov 90 uh, MAK uh, from eBay. Originally, I wanted to buy one of these, but it was 185. So I decided to buy a second-hand one, and I bought this for 110 And uh, I like it. Uh, it's more, mainly I bought it because of the stand of it. it stands, this stand can be used just for this bracket. I can use my uh, Celestron Maxitov C90 on this also. So I'm very happy. Also, it works. It has a tracking system is not a go-to you have to attach the go-to equipment to this but it tracking so when you turn it on like now you can actually track as you can see 
You can move it slowly with the battery or fast. Also, you can arrange it in a way that a, f a star which is on the field of view or a planet like Jupiter, Saturn, or a moon can be kept into the f in the field of view at least for uh, half an hour or more than that if you want to not bother with photography. But for photography, that's that's good. Then uh, it has also uh, one of these uh, um, uh, red dot dials, which I show you how it is. As you can see, the red dot. see that red, red dot should be centered I'll have to center it later and that's the finder that's better than the finder that the Celestron C90 has and I'm really happy with the quality I took some pictures from the I mean I couldn't really do anything because it was so cloudy now it is less cloudy and I can just use it probably I took it from the hedge in just front of our house and uh, not bad not bad for the price it's a Maxatov. Maxatov, also remember, Questor also is a Maxatov. And the image quality is good. I've seen one of these. I've used it once or twice. And uh, they're excellent. But that comes with the at a price. That's at least second hand of it is more than 1,500 or something like that. First hand, if you buy new, there's more than that, definitely. This is the closest you can get to that. Cheap. Thanks to China which builds these telescopes, the Skywatcher brand, I think the world is a richer place for everyone. And I like this telescope. I may have a review or show up if the weather permitting. Uh, I can use it uh, on the table. The main thing that I wanted was a stand that I can use on the table. You don't need a tripod to put it. Uh, it's difficult for in a modern British home to actually use anything other than a table <laughs> and uh, now we have something that goes with the British way of life and uh, it has a little lever bubble lever spirit level and it can I can just loosen it up from here I can turn it on twist it look altazimuth mount I can turn it around with this screw the screw here in the azimuth and if I loosen up the similar uh, clutch or screw here I can actually turn it off in the latitude so both of these when I lock them the remember this is on it's making that faint sound here It's telling to me that I'm on and also it has that flash and pressing this button it will turn oh I have to tighten up this one also tighten up that one And it comes with two beautiful uh, lenses, uh, eyepieces, which is good quality, two 1.25-inch uh, eyepieces. This one is a super 25 millimeter of the focal length of this, and this one is a 10, so it has a bigger magnification. Not necessarily any good, but anyway, it has this ability. Okay, I'll turn it off now because it uses eight batteries. Of course, you can attach the uh, power to this and also you can attach one of those go to ones as you know I'll show you with a flashlight on as I told this is this one is for a go to operators this is for a sky sync I think they call it and this is for the uh, power supply out or you can power tank attach this and this is for camera the thing is that it had an L bracket I didn't get that L bracket with this system uh, it was second hand, the person didn't have it. There's an L bracket that you can uh, install a camera, attach a camera to that. And also as a shutter, wire shutter, which I have for the Celestron Maxitov, I have it. You can connect your camera to this 
so they will be connected together you can just use them as a, a cable release for taking pictures and in total I'm really happy with this get the lens quality needs a bit cleaning probably but anyway I have a lens, cl lens cleaning kit is a proper eye cup rubber eye cup okay and I'm really pleased for 110 pounds, you can get a new one, I think 185 or 79, 179. It's better than any other telescope, especially equatorial mounts, which are really cumbersome. Anybody who has those ones, they cannot really use it much unless they live in a big house. And we are looking now through the window. Thank you. 